<laughs> Good morning, BHS. Today is January 13th, 2023. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces past, and I'm homebound. Staring blankly ahead, making my way, making my way through the crowd. And I need you. And I miss you. And now I wonder if I could fall into the sky. Do you think time? Tonight. 2023, there will be an enthusiastic class exploring painting with hot wax. The creative possibilities are endless. In acoustic is a versatile medium that allows the artist to build painterly composions very quickly. So if you're so if you would like to join us for this amazing class, then come on down. Roots and Bluestone will be playing Sunday, January 15, 2023, starting at 2 p.m. This is the second show of the Vermont Run. The duo will be hitting Snow Republic Brewery with a mix of covers and originals, including their most recent signal, single release, Arth Armorathus. Now over to Darian with World News. Change the power. <laughs> What's up? Uh, today for World News, I got a little story for you. So, the Trump Organization was fined $1.6 million, the, maxim, the maximum possible penalty, penalty by a New York judge fr this Friday for running a decade-long tax fraud scheme. Um, so yeah, $1.6 million is the most a New York judge can find someone. I'm sure they would have fined way more if they were able to. But, so the Trump, the Trump Corp was convicted for 17 felonies. Seventeen? Last month. Seven, yeah, that's 17 a lot. felonies. Felonies? Yeah. How are they I, not all in jail yeah, arrested? So Trump's a cool guy. Anyways, back to the announcements. All right. That was sweet. I am also going to commit some tax evasion as we approach MLK <laughs> Day. Learn more about his life and how we can carry on his mission. Join BOHS student group aware to learn about historical figures that have fought for our liberation and about how we can interrupt racism. This event will take place on Saturday, January 14th at 2.30 to 2 p.m. at the Brooks Memorial Library. January 28th is the Northern Roots Traditional Music Festival. It will take place at the Brattleboro Music Center and it will take place from 12.30 to 5.30 p.m. Now over to the weather with Rock. All right, uh, one sec while we get the weather up. Nothing? Technical difficulties, please stand by. <laughs> Tell us the weather, Rock. All right, on Friday, today, we got a little bit of rainy, you know, whatever. High of 48, low of 27. On Saturday, we got high of 32, low of 24 with cloudy. Sunday is also pretty cloudy, 36, low of 22. Monday is going to be sunny with a high of 36, low of 23. And Tuesday is going to be high of 45, low of 31 with some sun and clouds. Back to the desk. I love the weather. Anyway, on January 19th at the Vermont, or at the Vermont Arts Center, you can learn to paint with oils and fun, friendly, non-competitive environment. This class is ideal for those who have never painted before. No materials purchase is necessary. Just show up and the, enjoy the process. Do you want to try oil painting but don't know where to start? This workshop is designed for you. Over the course of the two-day workshop, you will learn how to set up a palette and pre prepare a surface and clean your brushes. Tickets cost $100 and the event will take place January 14th and 15th from 1 a.m. 1 p.m. to 3.30 p.m. at River Valley School of Art. Now over to Owen with Funny News. Unfunny. Yay! Yeah. Uh, 
What's news that? you got for us today? On January 12th, a message in a bottle washed up on the shore of the southeast coast of Ireland. El- Elaine Cullen, who was walking her dog on Roston Town Beach, where she found the bottle, the message was from Nova Scotia, Canada. So it went all the way across the ocean from Canada to Ireland. Um, it was <coughs> dropped in the water 18 months ago in July 2021. It was tossed off a fishing boat. What was the message? Something weird. (laughs) But um, the owner of the dog, the person who found it, did contact the person who wrote the message on Facebook because the letter and message was signed by the guy, the Canadian. Hmm. And the Irish person contacted them. And I think it's pretty neat how, like... A bottle with a message in it goes all the way across the ocean. Like, you never know who's gonna find your old stuff. You know what I'm saying? So, at that, yeah, yeah. At that point, it could just be like a random bottle it in like the random. middle of the ocean. Could be like a hundred years old, though, for they know. Well, if it wasn't signed, obviously. Yeah, if it wasn't signed, yeah. Could have been in there for a hundred years. All right. On January 17th, B I P O C. Black Indigenous <laughs> People of Color Carnis Carcass. Carcass. Okay. Is a meeting at the Root Social Justice Center on the first floor for their monthly meeting. If you would like to help er, with racial justice organization, this is where you want to go. There will be a snack and story workshop at the Brattleboro Food Co op. For this workshop, we are featuring beloved children's author Jan Bar- Brett. Participants are invited to listen to the mitten and make brown bear toast to enjoy it together afterward. This event will be on January 14th from 10 to 11 a.m. Now over to Hobby with the sports, whose birthday is also. Yeah, buddy. Thank you. So the ice hockey boys will be playing on Saturday, January 14th against Burlington High School here at 4:45. The ice hockey girls will be playing on Saturday, uh, January 14th against Hartford at 2 p.m. at the Barwood uh, Arena. Boys basketball team will be playing on Monday, January 16th against North Hampton High School at 7 at TBD. The girl, ba- girl basketball team will be playing uh, tomorrow again against Fair Haven Union at 2.30 p.m. at the FHUHS Gym. On Wednesday, January 18th at 2 p.m., the Nord- Nordic Ski Team will, be, will have a racing Brattleboro outing club. Also, the bowling team has a tournament <laughs> in Rulam Bowler Rama on Saturday, January 14th at 9 a.m. Back to this. Well, that was, that was some good sports. Anyway, join mm-hmm. us for the Lunar New Year Festival and celebration at the or at Brattleboro Museum and Art Center, brought to you by the Asian Cultural Center of Vermont. This event will be on January 22nd uh, from 1 to 4 p.m. Join us today, January 13th, at Ramonto's Pizza in Brattleboro for an open mic. Come on, come to 101 Mill Road, Bridgewater, Vermont from 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. This event will be free for everyone and also family friendly. Now over to a very special special with a special guest. Hello. Hello. I'm here with... Phoenix Chambers. Word. So, you know, we thought we might have a little special guest on the show today. Um, ask him a few questions. Not interview questions, though. Trivia questions. Let's see if you got what it takes to answer these questions. All right. <coughs> okay, first question. What is the name of the longest river in South America? Uh, uh, the, the Nile. Oh, wait. I got off. That's probably right. Yeah. Uh, where is the Great Barrier Reef located? Uh... Wisconsin. (laughs) 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 In Greek mythology, who is the queen of the underworld and the wife of Hades? Um, What's her name? uh, Miss Jackson. Miss Jackson. (laughs) Probably it. Yeah, probably. 
How many points are a touchdown worth? Seven. No. <laughs> Fuck. Um, in which ocean is the Bermuda Triangle located? Um. Uh, the, the, the eastern. <laughs> yeah, you got that one right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Thank you for joining us on this uh, little special. Back to the desk. Thank you. That was the worst special we've probably had so far. No, that was great. <laughs> what are, what are you talking about? You got all the answers right. <laughs> yeah, they were definitely right. Yeah, all right. Anyway, that's all we got for you today, but we've got a video from Tyler right after this, so stick around. Hello, and welcome to a fun, friendly game of Pictionary with my three friends. Okay, so, there's no subject, it's just whatever I can think of, and you guys don't have a time limit, so just watch, observe, and Girl. make a decision. All right. Okay. Huh. Mickey Mouse. A, a tree, a, a car. A cloud. A cloud. A cloud. Yes, it is a rock. So I got it. No, I said our No, uh, well, the camera didn't see it, so I'm pretty sure it was. What do you mean the camera didn't see it? One point to Darian. Yeah! Alright, this, this is already stacked against me. <laughs> 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 okay, next one. A cloud. A tree. Yes! Two points to Darian. <laughs> yeah. You're just gonna guess random objects. So this uh, one. Okay, that's my strategy. Oh, yeah. And then. All right, I'm gonna make this one's gonna be a little harder, okay? Mm-hmm. Watch it be like a line or like a skier. A the box. box. A juice box. Oh, oh, I can't. Pac-Man. A laundry machine. Arcade. Laundry machine. It's gotta be a laundry machine. Laundry machine. A moon. A, a Camera. Wa a washer machine. I'm literally guessing it. Outlet. Somebody no. doing the laundry. It's not an object. It's a phrase. Is it a phrase? Instagram. Or Instagram model. Instagram man. Uh, Darian, because he makes money on TikTok. What are you doing, Tyler? Guys, you're gonna run out of time here. What do you mean? Hundred money laundering. Yes. Money laundering. <laughs> what is that? Yeah. Good, Darian. You're very good at this game. Yeah. I got that okay. first point. <laughs> no, I didn't. I Next did. one. Hmm. Hold on. Ooh, yeah. Still think about this one. Is this the last one? No, there's two. We're doing two more. Okay. Two more? Jeez. I'm gonna get every point. Who no. Oh. A flag. Cool. A, frid, a piece of toast. Car. A van. A bus, a bus, Volkswagen. A bus, a bus. School bus. The mover. Motorized vehicle. A suitcase. 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 Chef. Uh, Battle bus. Yes. <laughs> Battle hey, bus. Daring gets another point. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Right, 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 Tyler. Yep. Four <laughs> points to Darian. This is. This. Okay, last one. Like last one, everybody. So focus up. Be last prepared. One. I got it. Wait, okay. can we do a um, all for one? Who? Do, like some of the. Yeah. Like this is for all the marbles. Nope. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is for everything. Whoever wins, this one wins. Darian, mm -hmm. Mr. Moore. A teacher. Restart. Stick me in. <laughs> Restart. Okay. So whoever wins this one wins the whole show. Or the whole thing? Yeah. Okay. No, we just win the... A duck. Star. Mr. Quacky. Oh. A joker. Darian. Yes! So I win. Darian. He guessed, I win. he guessed himself. How ironic. My ears don't look like that. Okay, now it looks like me. Your ears look like... I don't even know. <laughs> okay. What, what, what is this? That's anymore? all for today. So, thank you. <laughs> Everyone that joined and watched today. I totally won that. Darian.